Well, when I was a kid, I used to always come to these events. Um, came as a family all the time. It, it was a family thing we did. did it. Um, it means a lot to uh, us because it's, it says that our culture is still going strong and that uh, we, we can continue with this. You know, they talk about um, honoring the kids and, and there's, uh, you know, a sharing of community. It's open to everyone. What do you, what have you walked away with growing up from, from these gatherings? I've walked away with uh, a lot of knowledge. I'm still learning, actually. Um, being, uh, having a powwow just for the kids is a good thing because it's them that are going to be teaching their generation and the next generation after that. Learning, learning. Uh, I've learned from here. I've learned how to dance. I've learned uh, a lot of the teachings. I've, uh, I'm head dancer today, so I've I've come to that stage in my life too. So I, I'm I'm learning, and I'm still uh, still gathering knowledge. Head dancer. That's that's quite a feat. It's uh, it's it's a great honor. Um, they came up with to, to me with tobacco a few months ago and asked if I'd like to, and then. It's, it is a great honor to be uh, a head dancer here and to uh, honor honor the children. And what do you talk about kids? Like if they're asking you a question in the dance circle and you're going around, what are you what are you saying to them? Are you teaching them things? Most, th th there's a lot of stuff that can be taught through sight. Um, the visuals uh, like our regalias, they've, uh, a lot of the kids, learn off of that as well as the, the dance routines and stuff like that. Uh, mostly the parents will teach the children but if somebody, a smaller child comes up to me and asks me a question I will answer to the best of my abilities. Did you make your costume? Um, yes I made my regalia by myself and with the help of my mom. Uh, it took a few years, it's, it's all add-ons pretty much starting from when I was like five.